Faster, Scoob! Like he's gaining on us! Welcome, welcome, welcome to our photo studio, sir. We've got a special today for monsters only. Three prints for a dollar. Say cheese! doing in a city that's thousands of years old. Now we know what's been happening. We do? Give me a hand with this compressor, Shag. We're gonna use it to capture the tar monster. Like, what's going on? This is set up so the compressor won't start pumping air until we get back up to the surface. I sure hope this works. Look, it is working. Right, that ought to force our monster friend to the surface. There he is. Switch, so like he's getting away. Jeepers, we got him. Wait till the professor sees this. Now let's see who the tar monster really is. <coughs> Why, it's Stoner, my missing assistant. That's right, Professor. He posed as the tar monster to frighten off the local workers. <laughs> that way, he could sneak into the inner sanctum and steal its treasures before you could find them. <laughs> but how did he get past my guards? The answer to that begins with that ancient piece of pottery we found at the tar pool after following his tracks. The pottery had to come from the ancient city below. So when we found the connecting pool down there, we realized how he was getting into the city. I get it. Like he used his scuba gear to dive down through the tar. Yeah. All that's left now is to find the treasure. Stoner, where have you taken the treasures? Ah, I'll never tell. I think this map we found will show us where he hid everything. According to the map, there's a secret room behind this wall. There must be a way to open the wall, but how? Like maybe there's a hidden door. Yeah. Hey, look! Scooby found it! The treasure of Byzantius! How can we ever thank you? Our government will always be grateful to you. Hey, and don't forget Scooby! Scooby-Dooby-Doo! <laughs> 